Hello, 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 my beautiful friends. Welcome back to my channel. It's Marta here. Welcome, welcome, everyone. I hope you're doing good. I hope you are well and I hope you are ready for some quite exciting video, I hope. A video that you have been asking for for quite some time. But before we're gonna start, let me show you a sneak peek of the final project as well that we will do later on today. So stay tuned till the end. Please do. All about gelatos. Uh, as you can see, see on my desk plenty of those plenty different gelato sticks gelatos those are pigment sticks you have been asking me Marta how to use them what are they are they good are they worth the money should I get them and so on and so forth and to be honest I didn't use too many of them and I will tell you why maybe during this video the test we will be doing different tips uh, tricks techniques we will try I'm gonna show you that you will be hopefully able to understand and what's that product is about is it really worth the whole hype about it and uh, maybe it's just not for you I hope you will be able to tell this after the video and um, just so you know those gel sticks they do come into sizes double scoop a big size you've seen at the beginning and the regular size also they come in metallic colors and also regular colors plenty plenty to choose from they are gelatos and also gel sticks two different names but really I think the only difference in them is that one is for kids which is a cheaper version and another is for crafters for adults they really do work exactly the same the only difference is that uh, there is a less uh, choice of a color in the gel sticks for kids than for adults now as you can tell we are testing out on the black paper white watercolor paper and you can see that they smudging beautifully they work beautifully with water as well as you know they are water soluble very pigmented because the sticks are like a lipstick it's a huge amount of pigment uh, in a stick that you can really use for so many things you will see it for yourself. I'm going to show you some tricks and tips, ideas, how you can use it. At this moment, we are checking how they blend in. As you can see, like a butter, they really work beautifully. Whether you're using brush and water, whether you're just using your finger and blending it, they really do work beautifully. The same for metallics or regular colors. They really do work like a magic. As you can tell, you can nearly play with them like with watercolors. I'm trying to show you different colors, trying to show you how they match and blend they really are a beautiful pigments beautiful product in a stick and there are plenty out there products on the market with a different kind of um, packaging a different sort of look and I think it's a matter of preferences at the end of the day definitely this product as you will see later on has so many usage it's very pigmented it's water soluble as you can see it acts like watercolor it mixes beautifully uh, and you can definitely as well wash it off uh, that you will see it for for yourself later on I'm trying to use now a little bit of a brush with the uh, stick directly to the stick mm, doesn't really work that very well especially with the metallic one but with the regular color as you can tell with the darker color it does work so you can grab pigment directly from the stick very dark very highly pigmented unbelievably actually it's a fun time to play with gelatos and I really would say that yes it is a fantastic fantastic product um, do I love it do I like am I a huge fan of it I think I was but it changed over the years. Would you believe it that some of those gelatos are from probably eight years ago? They are still perfect. Nothing dried out. Nothing have happened to it. It is absolutely perfect working, looking beautiful and nothing have happened to it, which is a great plus. I have to say over the years I have uh, came across the mediums that I didn't use for six months maybe a year and they did dry out I have to say plenty actually have dried out with different paste different mediums and these gelatos are eight years old nothing happened to it uh, I'm adding extra layer of waxy gelatos because gelatos are waxes as well they are waxy water soluble and you will see how many mediums and what mediums and how mediums will work on top of them this is Posca white Posca which is fantastic product if you never had Posca markers you will uh, love it and this is another one that I have I forgot the name now but uh, it 
it kind of does work on it but as you can see very little nearly nothing is working on top of those this is a huge minus for me that if i want to draw something if i want to make uh, writing down it's really hard on it because they are so waxy they are so pigmented with the wax and oil in it kind of um yeah it's it's like really difficult to draw on it it has to be really like a beautiful good marker like posca pen um which is like a chalky pen and it does work other pens not so very much as you can see especially those three three moments three elements that i have added extra amount because the rest of the page was kind of washed off with the baby wipe and I added extra in, in, in the middle, as you could see, extra pigment and it wasn't that washed off. Just so you see that on top of regular um, gelatos, it's really nearly impossible to draw, depending on the medium she used. But probably this is one of the main reason that it kept me away from using gelatos. So every time I have been asked about why don't I use it or why will you use it or do you have it? I've been kind of staying a little bit away from gelatos. But you know what? After this test, because I haven't used my gelatos for I don't know many years now I have to say after this test I kind of sat down there and I was thinking Marta wow why didn't you use it? Why did you left it? Because it's really really fun product. It has many usage as you will see it for yourself. You can use it with water. You can now create paste as we will do. Uh, as you can see, this is a huge plus of gelatos because you can from this pigment make things. You can make paste. You will see as well, we will try to make a, a spray as well, watercolor spray. So you can make a paint from that actual pigment. So this is a huge, huge, huge thing I have to say. Mm, I'm gonna tell you about minus and pluses, pluses as we go but this is a huge 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 um, positive thing about gelatos because if you are small and with a budget you can use that pigment towards different um, like create paste or create uh, paint as you can see now I'm trying to paint with the actual pigment I added extra water and here you have it you can even use it directly through the stencil and use it as a paste which is fantastic by the way those stencils are from my store if you wish to check them out those are my designs i love them to bits just in case you're wondering um now i'm adding different mediums this one is gel medium this one is a heavy gel medium you can use any medium you want you can actually mix this with any medium you want i've used modeling paste as well and in a minute i'm gonna have also um, white gesso that you will see that you can really 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 use anything and just create your own custom made product you know you can mix different colors with it I've just done a test so you are able to see that yes this pigment does mix and works beautifully uh, depending what mediums you're gonna use it with it will become permanent I think um, kind of with gel medium but with gesso not so much so it it I wouldn't say that it's a prop permanent product whatsoever because it's a water soluble but if you mix it with gel medium it has a better chance to kind of be more more uh, forever uh, more than uh, on its own uh, doing more tests doing more tests and also yes you can as you can see you can try to use even back of the stencil it's kind of dirty left over on the stencil from the from the tests you can try to use this way as well because it's a great pigment that will transfer and go for for it now i'm using baby wipe with this and look at the beautiful mixture of colors and you will see in a second look at this one look 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 unbelievable beautiful pigment here that it's really gorgeous like the uh, how it mixes how it blends it's actually unbelievable uh you can see my baby wipe you can even use that baby wipe i've done some video using baby wipe on my background do you remember if you didn't there you go you you should check it out stamping out i'm going to show you a better way because i've started on the white and now we will start in a minute we will start uh, start on the black so uh, the amount of use of this pigment it's huge you can stamp with it you can paint with it it mixes beautifully you can treat it as a watercolor anything you really wish and as i said the only thing that kind of making me being away from it is because i cannot draw on top of it but 
the project that I will make in a second, you will see it. I absolutely loved it. And it, you know, oh, my favorite and your favorite five minutes journal <laughs> page. This page, can you see this one? This one, I don't have a process video. I lost it. I record a video for you. I got a gorgeous napkin from Vicky, I think, and I lost it. So there's no video and I'm so sad about it, especially that I've used napkin from one of you but there you go sometimes it happens so i'm using this test page look at it guys test page could be used like now on your background as your background why not sky is the limit guys open your eyes try to see things differently try not to look those doodles those trials of this silly silly trying out the actual testing out the pens why not you you are deciding you know you are deciding how and what you're using what way how you do it and um, where you're going to place things how you're going to play with it it's up to yourself art journaling mixed media in general collaging it is such a wonderful way of just feeling free and do however it feels good now for some reason i don't know why i felt like yes i'm gonna add some very plain <laughs> background paper i don't know why look you know me i don't have any plan ever i really don't by the way at the end of this video i will have a little bit extra tests as well for you so you will see uh overall extra things uh what else you can do with with actual uh, gelatos i think gelatos are great but even during the, I'm going to tell you in a minute why I think something else may be better. And so stay tuned to watch it. So we will see why I'm thinking this. Um, because I will be using a similar product I'm going to show you. By the way, those were digi papers from my store. If you didn't know, we have digital papers. Hooray! So many of you have been asking about and we've added paper dolls now, paper animals, which is like the gang. And so many of you have part. So feel free to check the shop, of course, marimismolart.com. It's instant download. Those are those circles as well plenty of them there uh, those are this, the, the instant download so you can print it yourself using your art as many times as you only wish now we have our background what we do now i'm just grabbing the pigment grabbing the stick just going in between those kind of elements where the paper meets up in those barriers in between kind of I don't know how to say it but anyway I'm just adding a little bit and you will see in a minute what I'm doing I'm playing with both metallics and regular ones and they I think either metallic seems to be more smoother or they are newer not as old as the other but honestly even the very old um, sticks that I have they work perfectly nothing has happened to them so that's a huge 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 positive thing I really have probably gelatos first set of gelatos was one of my very very first ever buy of professional supplies they were gelatos and I think this is what happens to most of you guys isn't it you do think that you need gelatos because they look so professional and they are so amazing in the packaging and all set of four set of 12 or whichever with a brush and a stamp that's how they used to be sold and then you don't know what to do with them because i don't think it's a, i don't think it's an easy product i really think it could be troublesome for those who are inexperienced and that's why there are so many questions how to use it do well will i use it look i've added some white gesso blending everything a little bit of wipe and gorgeousness background i mean seriously this is absolutely beautiful i love it i um, added just water just to kind of smoosh it out for whatever reason i felt i don't know drying out a little bit so we can start adding our circles i wonder how do you like the two camera angle i absolutely love it but you know it has to be also <laughs> a love for you so i wonder if that's a fun way of seeing the actual product the project and all um it's a very much more work for a creator like myself to actually mm, use two cameras it's far more editing but i love you too much and why not to make it a little bit prettier because i think it looks prettier in a way it gives you different perspective you can see it really really how it is i like both perspective i think 
and I think this came out pretty pretty nice I'm just using regular print stick this one the yellow one it's a gift from my beautiful friend thank you so much again I am so lucky to get not only those print stick but the punches the exact circles I never had those punches until Msiko have sent it to me so thank you so very much because she sent the punches so she knew that I didn't have it and I was punching out bigger circles uh, with the borders and she sent me the exactly shape and she said she had doubled so thank you so very much for thinking of me so I didn't have to cut it by hand it was much easier and so good so thank you so much um, I have to say that I'm so I'm so blessed privileged I'm amazed that I have so many of you friends that are thinking about me so much and wish to help me and wow it's just so amazing to know it to have you and thank you thank you thank you thank you so much now i'm gonna be adding a little bit of doodling around this one is just a charcoal not charcoal graphite pencil use charcoal or graphite now i can see and feel you don't really see it it's not that easy to draw it now i'm using around it the the actual gelatos and what i don't like about it minus about the gelatos there you go my favorite forever favorite three-in-one woodies i love the fact that they are pointy and it's much easier to actually go around it with edges with the you know around the edges make a writing anything like because they point you can you know use your sharpener and it's perfect you cannot really do that with gelatos so i think it's a big minus of that product i don't know if it's possible to do it differently but certainly the fact that they are coming very much flat unless it changed because I didn't purchase them for years and years but what I think what it is what it was always they flat end so they're not sharp and this is something I just probably I'd be more keen towards Woody's 3-in-1 from Stabilo that's why and this is a Lamy this is different brand because I was testing and I'm gonna show you a test version of different Woody's different 3-in-1 uh, fatty pencils as I call them I'm just using brush and water and there's no plan here. I'm just squishing some water here and there So everything is gonna be more sloppy. Is that a word like more? You know anyway, I if you feel that I'm super excited I am because today is the 8th of June I've been in hairdressers for the first time since 10 months <laughs> Because of the current situations as you know, so I'm super happy and excited that I could finally do a little bit something for myself And it's so much fun and I'm glad to be back and smile to you. I miss you terribly but it's just so um, hard to be on top with everything i hope to kind of um i have plenty of pre-recorded recorded videos i hope to quickly add them to the youtube video and be more regular in recording and be more current with actual recording it which is hopefully possible now i'm doodling doodling you didn't see that no you did see but i didn't say i doodled with everything i had around and because of the waxiness of the actual page itself because of being used gelatos not everywhere i could draw and that's good and bad good because bad because if you want to draw it's very hard but good because it's not so perfectly finished so I think that's good and bad. That's the also newest Digi papers, which I oh, totally love. I mean, look at those creatures. Not that I draw them. No, no, no. These are beautiful vintage images that are, that I found or purchased for you so you can use them and yeah look at them and there will be a silly conversation between those two but you know what I just love the quirkiness of it and recently I'm more into quirkiness and all so check the digital papers oh these are the new papers the recent 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 dolls that I absolutely love and I also wanted to say that if you cannot afford which is perfectly fine digital papers I have digital papers for free on the coffee page just go in there jump into coffee page link is below the video um and just pay zero put zero amount pay with it and you will be able to purchase those pages digital papers from coffee page it's buy me coffee it's called buy me coffee but you don't have to buy me coffee the idea is that i made this purposely for you to be able to get free papers because not everyone can afford it so that's awesome and it's a win-win situation because those who can afford to serve a coffee not serve a coffee like a, get me a coffee as a thanks those who can afford it do it those who cannot they cannot and that's perfectly fine i think it's a wonderful opportunity for everyone to have the same papers <clears throat> excuse me i even lost the voice i still cough <clears throat> believe it or not 
after what is it seven weeks i think seven or eight weeks now but it's it's much better things are good so don't worry we're doing a little bit of outlining as you could see underneath of those two creatures gorgeousness creatures i have put some white gesso so they would stand out more because the page is so quirky so colorful so busy that those two is it a badger or is it a squirrel and a rabbit either way the two cutenesses and now yeah we cannot really see what they say so i'm gonna change that you will see now put it on the white cardstock so um yes so we could see everything better both the badger and the squirrel and <laughs> the bunny whatever they are i don't know much and also the sayings and those are stickers from my store as well of course kind of do you know what i think sometimes that i use either sometimes i feel that it's too much of my products from my store that i constantly <laughs> talk about use my product get it from my store and i feel so bad and then when i use other products i feel that those who already purchase my products feel that there is not enough projects made with my product so it's kind of like i have those battles inside my head constantly constantly i i battle and i i think i should i should do this i should do that and i shouldn't and this and that and i'm trying to fight over with that and just do what feels good and right at the moment and of course ask you for opinion Anyway, I hope you're enjoying this chit chat, my smiles and uh, my happy voice because I'm super, super happy, excited. Hopefully I'm going to plan a live. So watch my YouTube video. Please subscribe to my channel because there will be a live session coming definitely with some digital papers. I'm going to have new free digital papers as well for the coffee page. So everyone will be able to create something. Probably it's going to be some dolls, I'd say. I don't know yet. I don't know. I didn't do it yet. But watch this space my facebook page my instagram and this youtube channel subscribe guys so you won't miss it click that bell button as well and of course and if you wish for more videos even more than what i'm already giving <laughs> you you can join my membership it's a paid extra little a dollar or five or ten or whichever level you wish but if you wish for more videos here you have you can join the membership but be sure to use uh, either laptop pc or phone this option to join doesn't show on app uh, on the ipads and also if you're already a member please check community tab i know there's so many members actually there's plenty of you thank you thank you so much members for supporting this channel so i can provide free videos like today it's amazing that this allow me to actually create a proper lovely content and not content that it's sponsored but i can create videos that you've been asking for video about gelatos how many times i've heard so i hope this is meeting your expectations guys it's a fantastic fantastic product and i think i didn't use it enough and i don't think it i think it deserved to be much more used and really loved i love the page it's so cute i really love the page i really love it i love how abstract that is with the vintage animals i mean seriously in this silly talk hey you you are loved oh okay <laughs> i mean yeah maybe because i'm polish and my english isn't the perfect most perfect always this is what we have but anyway i hope you still like it because i had so much fun creating this page and i'm glad that actually in the test video i've done a showcase of a product let me know if that's something good for you that you know using the product project a product making a project while testing out look we're gonna test it out very warm water very warm water in that bottle to see if it's I'm, i've never done that i didn't create um, spray so i didn't know whether it's gonna work or not so it's a here is a test here is a test let's see let's see <laughs> look at it already this is how it's pigmented this is gonna tell you that it's crazy pigmented wow it's really wow um i think there's so many amazing products out there that every product shows something different it's used for something different so if i'll be asking ask between woodies or gelatos or scribble sticks from dina or maybe tim holtz or they all different I have my favorites maybe someday I will show it to you or t talk to you maybe you would like me to compare more I've definitely there's a video coming with the three in one pencils I've bought so many sets I've tested it out I have my opinions I'm gonna share it with you soon um, but certainly it was a good 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 video to try a great topic great idea to try 
the actual gelatos because I didn't play with them for years and I think it's a my mistake I'll be back to them so if you have gelatos keep it because I think it's a fabulous product uh, just not for everything and not for everyone maybe but I think it's lovely actually it has so many uses, uses I have to say uh, I really like that I really really like it very pigmented water soluble huge uh, choice of colors and um, as i said mine is a couple years old nothing has happened that's a huge 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 thing beautiful tissues i'm gonna wrap up with that my friends wishing you a lovely day and um, yeah i hope you are well stay healthy happy and i'll chat to you very very soon i love you bye